So, let me just get some music on for myself. Although I hoped I managed to get Bing to make a dry roll plane tutorial, clearly it didn't happen. So, should I make one? You know, that'd be kind of funny. It's not going to be good. Um, I'm not going to explain it very well, I'm just hoping you can follow what I do. And I'm going to use a shopping cart because I'm lazy. No, you know what, I'm not. Yeah, I am. Yeah, I am. So, we would, I would use thruster steering if I was bothered. <laughs> oh man, this is going to be so lazy. I just, I just want a tutorial to be out there for how to make this, these things because they are so fun to fly and when I wanted to make one months ago, like April, I looked on how and nothing was there. So, you know, if nobody's going to tell me how to make one, I'm going to tell everybody else how to make one. Because there's probably some logic there. <laughs> okay, so what I've already done here is rotate Z four times on that wing. Okay, we're going to have to rotate Z four times on that wing. And then we rotate X four times on each simulated server. So now we've got four wings placed, six connectors and two simulated servers. Going to put a wing on each simulated server. And then a wing on the end of the middle wing to make the wings a bit longer, which increases stability somewhat. Why am I making this so formal? I don't, I don't do formal videos, what the hell? Uh, then we're going to get four, now that we've done that, we're going to get four of these guys. Input sensors, oh my god, I've not, I've not said the words out loud for ages. Am I in a VC? <laughs> Phew, okay. Uh, don't need people joining my call while I'm recording. That's just embarrassing. That doesn't look upright to me. Upright. Fix. Okay. Oh man. Road to Granby's best game ever. That is A, not D. So you're gonna want to set the front ones to A when you make this. Gonna turn on rest limit enabled, set the limit angle to 27, which is really sensitive, but that's how I do it. Oh, I'm gonna have to show people how to do the steering right, because I, I do steering weird, because I'm bad at playing. Um, <laughs> okay, so then you're gonna, I'm also gonna make the, maybe a suspension thingy, because that seems kind of practical somehow. I think that makes sense. Uh, that look good. That looks good to me. Gonna put a wing there. Now the up down sensitivity is gonna be crazy right now, so we've gotta do that. And have two wings upward. Meaning we can also have a wing here. Not there. It's the that's the wrong spot. Here and here. By the way, that is a long stick and one no, just two sticks, not all one long stick. They're basically the same length. Rotate Z four times on each. And get two more simulated servos, which are going to go there and there and there. Uh, gonna rotate X four times. Okay. Four input sensors. Now it's gonna be, that one I believe is W. Let me just check that. There's not a wing on it. <laughs> Oh, look at this. I'm struggling. Uh, okay. Yeah, that's W. So if you're used to having your steering so that W is down, I'm going to say set this to S. And this one here is going to be W for you. I'm setting it to S. Because I, I learned to fly planes the wrong way. That's going to be S. That's going to be W, W, is that, yep, that's a straight line, that's going there, limit enabled, rest, 27, and that is indeed a gyroless steering system. Now, all we've got to do is get an input sensor and a spinner, and then the propeller item, because I am too lazy to do it the right way. That's a big, that is a big propeller. Whatever. Uh, nope, that's not going to take off. Oh no. 
I didn't expect that to happen, to be honest with you. I can put it there, but we'll just be moving downward a bit. Look at that, that's good. Come on, come on, there we go. So, okay, did I not set D? Okay, we're just turning left. Look at that. So it's a bit hard to lift off, but it works. We're just gonna set D into the controls. So D is gonna be the back ones. You don't need to set that reversed if you want to, unless you are really weird. I'm not judging people. I'm just saying that's just not right. <laughs> Mate, don't set don't set D to left. I, even if you're left-handed, that's still wrong. Like no matter what, you shouldn't be used to that. Get help. <laughs> uh, yeah. So let's see. Let me go over some issues with this right now. The back is too sensitive, so we're gonna have to lower the back sensitivity massively to down to. I'm gonna go twice and then that way. Same with this one, twice and then that way. I am definitely recording, right? <laughs> um, that's that. Secondly, I want to have two short sticks here because although the shopping trolley has almost no grip, it's, it still gets on my nerves how hard it is to get this thing off the ground. And we're gonna do that. I'm gonna get. I would do suspension, but this thing is just like so easy flying. You don't need it. Gonna do wheels just because it looks better on the size of plane, and it doesn't really matter. You could just use spinners, but this is easier on a road that way. We're then going to get a spinner. Okay, we're gonna get a rotate Y tool, I believe. There we go, four times there. And now we've got that back wheel in, which is gonna lower grip massively on the back. There we go, look at that. That stabilized pretty quick. And we can turn corners. That's a giant rudder's plate. It's a bit shaky because the small tail fin and how far back the tail fin is, it should be at an angle, but I am too lazy. <laughs> the tail fin doesn't really matter how big you make it. So now we're just gonna get a loop done to prove that this thing, but yeah, these things. So the way you turn, you hold uh, sideways, then you hold up, then you hold sideways the other way. This is too fast. I'm gonna have to turn this into a thruster based. But yeah. Oh, I see the propellers pulling it down. That it's not a lack of stability. But yeah, uh, that's that. How long was that? Eight minutes. Eight minutes, and I've showed you how to do something. So, um, oh my god, why are these propellers so strong with the wings? So they need to change that. Yo, if dev watch, please. Um, <laughs> can you please, in the next update, make wings like have a bit more resistance? Because I don't know if it's unrealistic or not. I've never made a plane in real life, but it feels it. Like the shake, I get the shaking, but but it just feels. So so, I don't know, just unrealistic. And don't, you know, it, I don't know. I, I just feel like it had improved planes a bit. So yeah, there we go. That's way better. Look at that. Propellers base stuff is usually better because infinite fuel. I would have done a custom propeller, but I have to explain how they work and that takes time. So we are gonna save that. Save to, gonna call that my first my first physics plane. There you go, that's your first physics plane, maybe. And when you load it in, the, uh, I forgot. Um, to uh, make this load in properly, you've got to hold W and D. Okay, and then get out the chair. Then you're going to save it, okay? And now when you load it in, the control surfaces will be flat, flat out. Meaning this just glides down how it glides when you're flying it. See? Look at that, that is crazy stability i've never made one that stable but yeah there you go that's a 10 minute tutorial on how to make a physics plane or a gyrolus i used to call them physics planes that's just what i do bye